today is a very special day. You see this nice afro here? I'm finna cut it off. I'm just playing time. I'm gonna flat iron it today. Because I've never flat, I haven't flat ironed my hair since I went natural. I um, was transitioning as soon as I got to college because I hadn't gotten a relaxer since I had, um, actually, I hadn't gotten a relaxer since probably before I graduated high school. So I haven't transitioning for maybe a couple months. Like, I was transitioning from like the summer up until. February of 2015 and I cut it off so it is <laughs> September 2016 so like a good year and a couple months has passed and this is what I have so I want to flat iron my hair and see what it looks like um, people keep telling me it's gonna be hell long and yeah i'm excited i need to also trim my ends so that's what i'm doing today so if you are interested in seeing what my hair looks like and see if i fuck it up or not you know stay tuned hopefully it goes well you guys thank you so much for watching and Okay, y'all. Moment of truth. I'm about to put some. My hands look real bad. So, I started using this Jamaican Black Castle Strength and Growth and Strength and Growth Thermal Protectant. And I use it when I blow dry my hair, and it seems to be really good for my hair. So, we're gonna see what happens when I flatter it. I'm really nervous because as you can see I'm knocking everything down so like I'm so scared um right now um I'm gonna turn my flat irons down because they go from like 180 to 460 and I'm kind of like not burn my hair off so I'm gonna keep it relatively low so, yeah. spray that on there. 
massage it in. And do the back too. I'm gonna brush through my hair one more time. Now, I've seen where people do like the chaser method. I'm gonna take my glasses off, which I don't like. Because I can't see clearly. But like, you put a brush in the hair, and then the flat iron chases it. And I've seen the Glam Twins do it on their hair, so I'm gonna, I guess I'm gonna see. How this goes on my hair. Y'all see how like mine. Y'all see a snapback? Y'all see watch, watch, watch. Snapback. Like ridiculous, right? So let me see for the first time. I'm so scared. Cause if I fuck up my hair, it's my hair. But I also have wigs. Y'all, let's see what happens. Oh my God, okay. Y'all, I don't think it's hot enough. Yeah, I don't think this is hot enough. My hair holds heat like a motherfucker and this ain't doing too much so i'm gonna crank it up a little bit more y'all oh my god oh my goodness oh my goodness oh my goodness Y'all, this is nerve wracking because, like, I want my hair to be able to revert that. To the natural curl pattern without damaging it so now I'm gonna do the chaser method with the ends I don't see no hair is burning off Yeah, those might be the ends that I'm cutting. Y'all see this? Oh, peep the length though. Boom. It looks so weird and thin like, but no it don't. It look kinda thick. It just look weird at the ends because but I guess this is when I started growing out my natural hair. So the oldest parts of the hair are the most important to take care of and get these roots. One more be done.
so yeah. Alright y'all, let's do the rest of the hair. What's up, y'all? So, this is a complete fail, okay? Because look at this. It's not like I want it. And no matter how much I flat iron it, it's just that. I don't feel like it. And I'm not going to do this to the rest of my head. I'm about to go to a professional. Like, I'm. So let's just call this a fail. Okay? And I just fail at flat ironing. I'm never gonna flat iron my hair. I'm never gonna flat iron. But I'm gonna move on. Do other things. Cause it's hot too. So. Bye.